In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the destination folder must be empty error in Steam. So this is actually really easy to fix. We just need to head over to the start menu on your computer and search for settings and then click on the settings window. From the left hand side, click on apps, select installed apps, and then using the search box at the top here, just search for Steam. And once you've found the Steam application, click on these three horizontal dots and press uninstall. Now, once you've uninstalled Steam from your computer, head back over to the start menu, search for folder options, and then click on file explorer options. Then select view, and underneath hidden files and folders, make sure show hidden files, folders, and drives is turned on, and then press apply and okay. Then we can head over to the file explorer on our computer, and you just need to head inside of the drive where you have Steam installed. Now, usually this will be located on your C drive, so I'm gonna double click on this. Then double click on program files, and we just need to scroll down until you see the Steam folder. Now, if you have a folder in here called Steam, then simply right click on it, press the trash icon to delete it. And then once you've done that, you can come back over to the previous window, double click on program files x86. And once again, if you see the Steam folder here, we're just going to right click on it and then press the trash icon to delete it. Now, if you get this message pop up, just press continue. And then once you've deleted both of these folders, you can head over to an internet browser and then just re-download the Steam application. And it's as simple as that guys if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments and i'll see you in the next